Okay, we are at part two of this question. Let me erase uh, the previous rough work. Now, on the diagram on page 25, the ordered pairs shown in the table have been plotted except for the missing ones. Using your answers, your answer in A1, your answers in A1, plot the missing points and connect all the points with a smooth curve. All right. So this is the graph. What we have here, 0 0.1, 10.3. That was what they had. You notice that there is one, two, three going all the way out here. 0 0.1. You had 0 0.1 and 10.3. So this is uh, this is one point. This is point two, four, six, eight, and one whole. You know it's not zero point. Oh yeah. This part, right. Remember, this is one. And that one from here to here divided into one, two, three, four, five parts. So one divided by part by five is zero point two. So from this line to this line is zero point two. So half of that is zero point one. So halfway between these two lines. So if you go straight up, you see this point plotted here is zero point one. And you see 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and a little more. That's 0 0.1, 10.3, and so on. That's how they do it. Now, they also have the 0 0.2, 5.6. 0 0.2 plotted to 5 point. You have 0 0.5 and then a little more, 0 0.6. Now, the point that's missing that you're supposed to plot is 0 0.5, 3.5. 0.5, So, we're looking at 0 0.5. This is 2, 4, 6. Zero, so, remember, this is 0 0.2, 0 0.4, 0 0.6. Halfway between 0 0.4 and 0 0.6 is 0 0.5. So we're going to go up this way. And the other point is 3.5. So we have, let me just get rid of it, I would need it. So we have 0 0.5, 3.5. So let's locate that. 0 0.5, 3.5. This is exactly 3. This is 4, so halfway between 3 and 4 is, is 3.5. It would be right here. So, 0 0.5, 3.5, looks like this is the point. And the next missing value is 2, 6.5. So, we locate 2 and, goes up, and go up 6.5. Yeah. This is beside 1, beside 2. Beside 3, beside 4, beside 5, beside 6. Up here is 7. So halfway there is 6.5. So 0. Point, so it's 2, 6.5. So it's going to be right here. Alright. And then they say, plot the missing points and connect with a smooth curve. So we're going to connect them with a smooth curve. All these points. Now, my curve is not going to be as smooth as you could make it on a real graph paper. All right, but I'll try. Remember, I'm not using a real pen and paper now. I'm using a drawing tablet and stylus to do it. So yours should be smoother than mine. Smooth curve going up and up and up like this. 
Okay, that's my curve. Now, what we'll do is look at part three later on.